Good morning, you guys. I made myself a matcha tea earlier. I just refilled it with a little bit of more hot water to dilute some of the matcha powder that was in the bottom. And then I made Matt his own little green tea because his throat is still hurting, but it's 10 times better. And it's really been helping him with some organic green tea from Costco. I'm just gonna surprise him with it. Matt. Oh. Uh. Careful. Use the cup. <laughs> oh, it's hot? Yeah. <laughs> Damn it, use your sleeve. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. Love you. Welcome back to Vlogmas. It's currently Vlogmas Day 7. Well, it's December 7th. I don't know if it's like technically Vlogmas Day 8 because I'm going to post this probably the next day or the day after. I have no idea. Hopefully when you're seeing this, it's December 8th. Today's video is going to be solely surrounded about self-care because I wanted to do a whole body reset on skin my whole body because my birthday is on sunday so i feel like it's appropriate to have like a day of self-care after working all week i feel like i should end off my weekend by relaxing taking time for myself take the time to unwind and relax for once without having to worry about work but today's gonna be more of the self-care to myself prior to my birthday out of my top five self-care priorities mental health being my first and gut health being my second and then of course my skincare now if you've been watching me for so long you know that I have been sticking to my skin routine every single morning and every single evening for years now Even though I'm not an expert I like to trust my skincare products that I'm putting on my face because it's precious to me I think we all can agree that we all would like to feel safe putting products on our skin because the skin on our face is the most sensitive part of our body So I'm also filming a TikTok today It's gonna be a morning vlogmas and then it's also gonna be a nail vlog I'm gonna go get my nails done after I head to the gym because the nail place opens 30 minutes and I feel like I can get a workout in before I go get my nails done. So let's start on our self-care day. I'm going to add in the nail TikTok vlog into this vlog. So I'm not going to bring my camera to the nail salon because it's obviously so bulky. I can't just put this in somebody's face. So you're going to see me get my nails done through TikTok and I'm going to come back to the vlog camera right after I get my nails done. Let's go get this workout in. Cheers. I'm going to be straightening my hair for my birthday. We're going in with a hair oil. I'm getting my nails done. My first set right now is like this dark green for like a little pine Christmas tree type color. I'm debating because I never get red. I feel like getting a really dark red. Like usually I get a dark burgundy for the fall, but I feel like I want to get like a very, very dark cranberry red. Same shape, just a little shorter. I just realized we forgot to eat. Picking up some Chick fil A real quick. I just want some nuggies, some of them waffle fries. Oh. That's so mm -hmm. Oh my god. I just got a chunk of strawberry. I have yet to still decide what color I'm doing, so I'm gonna decide what I'm inside. Never so got <laughs> what I decided to do. Don't know what. <laughs> I've never done chrome before. I was like mesmerized. We did a dark red chrome. Literally looks like I got ornaments Ooh. on the tips of my fingers. Got them festive for the holidays and for my birthday. Got them short enough for me to still box in my gloves.
officially the afternoon. My nails are done. If y'all saw them in the TikTok, they look so cute. I got them in a red chrome. I just finished working a little bit and now it is currently about to be evening. It's around 4.30 and I still haven't taken a shower since I went to the gym or came back from the nail salon. So I feel nasty. I'm gonna take a shower and then prep my little bath night. <laughs> your opinion. Hey you guys, I currently got some chocolate chips in my mouth. We're out of the shower. I'm so fresh and so clean. I got a pumpkin face mask on. Matt is currently deep cleaning the tub before I go in it because he loves to do that for me before I make myself a little bath. Don't know if he's gonna join me yet, but I feel like he should. He deserves it after cleaning that whole tub. While he's doing that, I'm going to be making some banana bread. I've been waiting to make this for so long because I was gonna use these two bananas, but I was waiting for them to get really black because that's when you know it's the sweetest, but this is as dark as they got. And I was waiting for today to make it, but I guess we're gonna work with this. So first, I'm gonna start with the dry and wet batter. I think I have to do the dry batter first. Starting with the flour. I make my own flour. I don't buy flour anymore and I blend up oats, so this is technically oat flour. A cup of the flour. Salt. That's already it for our dry batter, but I'm gonna add some cinnamon and some allspice. I'm literally winging this. I don't do any measurements. You know, when it comes to baking, I kind of just wing it. Oh, yeah, you can tell. I just realized that I have to put the dry ingredients in the smaller bowl so that when I put the wet ingredients in this bowl, I, all I gotta do is pour it into the bigger bowl. Transfer all that here. Again, the bananas are not fully black, so it's not gonna be at its sweetest, but it's gonna still taste good. We got two bananas, it smells really good. Mm. Gotta mush these bananas. And then right after, I'm going to add softened butter, brown sugar. I needed vanilla extract, but I don't got that, so might just put some peanut butter in it. First, I'm gonna smush these bananas until they're super smooth and soft. And then I'm gonna add all the rest of the ingredients and then add the dry ingredients to the wet batter. flower. Okay, now I'm gonna add the chocolate chips. I am not a fan of dark chocolate, but I freaking milk chocolate. Mm. Even though it gives me acne in like a day. I'm gonna mix it with dark chocolate. Thank you. 
Guys, the poppy cranberry fizz probiotic soda is to die for, I promise you. Out of all of their flavors, I honestly feel like this is my favorite and it sucks because it's seasonal, but this is by far my favorite. Please try to check these out on Amazon or, whole, or your Whole Foods or just their website in general. this on tonight but I realized that I cannot straighten my hair while this is in my hair but I don't know for sure so I decided that I'm going to wash my hair again tomorrow and then I'm gonna straighten it take care of the curls at least while it naturally dries so far the bake bacon what am I saying the banana bread finished baking so I'm gonna have a little taste of that and I'm gonna make some noodles because we had leftover noodles but then we finished it all so I'm gonna make more noodles because I am craving it and I saw one on TikTok and I just wanted to make my own real quick so I think the banana bread looks perfect I just gotta test it Oh, it's perfect. There's literally no. Ah! Okay. It's my early birthday cake. All right, let's wait for this to cool off. A little shrimp ramen and the ramen i get in the pack is from costco and it's literally so good it fills me up loki now i'm just gonna sit on my couch watch some netflix and even edit this video so that i can have it ready for tomorrow i'm gonna sleep a little late today and sleep in a little bit tomorrow for friday